Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. What is up? It's Castle Perfect, bringing you something beyond what we're used to see. Something incredible. Something the best humiliation I've ever seen. The best defense I've ever seen. Amazing. All right. So this match is against Mike, a guy from Skype, a fellow Dutch person. We decided, we agreed on a OU match, and here we are. I'm gonna lead it with my. Uh, Garchomp, aka Laser. I'm gonna go for Fire Blast against his Forceress. I thought he would stay in to try to set up the Stealth Rocks, maybe thinking that I don't have Fire Blast. But he was smarter and goes out into Jellison. Now, Jellison takes the Fire Blast like a monster, of course. It's not super effective, it's not stabbed, and Garchomp doesn't have the best special attack in the world. So, I make his dumb switch here into a Heat Seeker, aka Mahidran, thinking he might go for something along the lines of, I don't know, Shadow Ball, Ice Beam. But instead he goes for the water spout, Get, catch, catches me completely off guard, takes out my heat seeker, and in comes laser once again to threaten everything that is on the field. I'm gonna go for the outrage, basically just to get rid of the jellicent right off the bat, because I think this jellicent is also choice scarfed, but I'm not sure, I never actually gained any uh, knowledge about that Pokemon while we were battling, not even after. So. He is gonna bring out his Genesec. Now, downloads, download ability gets activated. Of course, his ability gets special attack boost. Is faster than my Garchomp Choice Scarf with Adam and Nature max speed, of course. Jesus, that's a speedy motherfucker for sure. Now, ladies and gentlemen, here is where the fun starts. I will leave you with some epic music for an epic moment. Enjoy. The best setup ever, and the best humiliation, and the fucking best persistence I've ever seen. This, ladies and gentlemen, has proved that multi scale ability is not only overpowered, but it's definitely the best defense there is in the entire meta game. Dragonite, you definitely deserve a Oscar. You deserve an achievement. So I've never ever thought in my wildest thoughts that you could live through such a devastating move. That's just beyond my imagination, alright? That's just fucking abnormal, alright? Whew, damn! Never seen something like this, guys. Alright, let's continue the narration, shall we? Okay, so. <laughs> In comes Dragoon as in comes top of the tier, aka Mr. Garchomp. I activate my Intimidate, get the attack dropped. He goes for the Dragon Claw and I was like, oh yes god, this guy is amazing. Why? Because after the attack drop, I am gonna be able to set up a Dragon Dance, become faster than him, Dragon Dance again, leave another Dragon Claw, and I will leave with enough HP to pull off a third Dragon Dance which will allow me to outspeed the Genesect and in the end 
get me the victory. Gyarados, you are such a monster. You definitely are. Alright guys, so basically this commentary has gone beyond something that I've ever done before. I was just so shocked by the results of a bullet punch, Caesar max attack with Adam and Nature. You know, technician boosted bullet punch, everything at the same time. Neutral damage. Multi skill. Stopped it. It's just. Ah, oh, it's so unbelievable. I still cannot believe it. And even after rough skin here, Gyarados leaves on. That just goes to show the Dragon type Pokemons. Well, I mean, Gyarados is not a Dragon type Pokemon, but it definitely resembles one. He is an awesome Pokemon, just like Dragonite. Which basically can live through everything as long as it's got multi skill and full HP. So, in the end, guys, I thank you very much for watching. Uh, outstanding match, absolutely beast event. And nothing else to say here, guys. I'm astonished. Thank you for watching. Definitely comment, rate, and subscribe. Let me know what you think about this awesome, awesome defense.